What's up, sexy similar squad today? We're here doing a rank 1v1, and today is a day we play Hachiman. A lot of people requested it in, I believe, um, Northern Ranger. That's kind of cool. That's kind of cool. Oh, I heard you had a monster that needed hunting. Oh, shit, he looks straight up Uller. Hey, look at this. I've seen that. Should I use this one? I popped a skin booster, so I don't know which one to use. Yeah. Yeah. It does look like Uller. Looks ah! That's a set! Oh god! <laughs> oh lord! <laughs> it's okay. Anyways, uh, we're playing Hachiman today because all the comments said that... Well, not all the comments, but a lot of comments and a lot of likes were on those comments that said that they would like to see a Hachiman game in Friday's video, I think it is. So... I think I just go ages. So yeah, that's what we're doing. We're playing Hachiman because a lot of people wanted to see it. Um, make sure that you do comment gods that you want to see because it does help me with ideas because I need ideas all the time. Uploading two videos a day um, really does just like shoot ideas out of you all the time. Like I'm empty. But um, anyways, make sure that this video gets 1500 likes because I just recorded another game that I'm going to be uploading next. And, uh, that game was awesome, and funny, and competitive, slightly. Mm -hmm. So, the game was just good all around, so make sure you get this video to 1,500 likes, so I can upload that other video, and everyone can be better off for it. I'll end you right now. Yeah, that's, that's what I thought. You ain't nothing until late game, boy. Got his bracer and he's back in. Oh, wow. You think you're all that now? Back up. Trust me, I play enough set to know you don't win these. By the way, I win multi-pots because Hachiman's passive is... A fucking insane amount of MP5. So I have health pots and multi pots and speed buff and still a shit ton of mana. So. Alright. Just clearing wave, man. Just clearing wave. Alright. <clears throat> I think he's doing his speed buff right now before he comes to lane, so I'm gonna just do some tower damage here. Not really much to it. I assume you're gonna teleport? No? Okay. He hit me with an ability and I didn't hit him at all and I still outgraded him. <laughs> We can do red though, right here. I may lose it. I don't know what that accent was supposed to be. I was gonna say may and might at the exact same time. Came out as mate. Almost like someone with Australia, someone from Australia, but they don't have a jaw, and they're trying to say mate. That's what it is. God, I do so much damage, dude. Oh, greedy! Okay, whatever. He didn't ult. I'm good. Oh. I'm dead. Alright. That's okay, honestly. We're farming really hard right now. So even though he just killed me, he's 100 gold ahead. Which is no big deal. And I finished my transcendence already, so... While, yes, dying there was definitely not ideal, it wasn't actually as bad as it seems. I'm just gonna farm up these buffs. 
Stack this transcendence. And I am going to start doing quite a bit of damage now. Got some attack speed boots. Dump a little bit of respect sauce on that. Why do I even bother? I'm a master tracker. I don't know. Do you level your three or your one? Definitely your three. Oh, my auto did 113. That's actually a lot. Oh my gosh. But I actually do so much damage. I hit him with my two and two autos, and he's half health. not good. I had to waste alt there. It's very not good. I'm pretty sure I lose red buff because of that little misplay. Which sucks buttholes. Oh, that did a lot of damage though. Honestly, all we're doing is trying to annoy the shit out of him. Oh my god, that was such a sick snipe on the on the red buff. Hell yeah. Banana bread? At work, dude? Hell yeah. Alright. Pretty good. So even though we did get first blooded... Um, we're doing really well right now. We're ahead in XP, we're ahead in gold, and yeah, I'm down one kill, but does that matter when I'm ahead in literally every aspect of the game? I mean, I don't think so. That's why I love this new map, man. It's not so snowball-y. It's not one kill ends game like the other map. This map is really like, how well can you play, period. If you get outplayed once, you have a chance to farm up, you know? One loss doesn't, or one uh, misplay doesn't lose you the game immediately. It's a good map. The best trade deal in history. Does he have defense already? No. He does have transcendence. But it's not stacked, so. Holy shit. I just did so. I did a thousand damage in six autos. My one hit for 311, my two hit for 300. Jeepers. We got his bracer there, too, and he still died. Okay. Hachiman's broken. I don't know why I'm surprised. Every single time I play this character, I fucking smack and then I never play him again. I don't I don't know why, dude. I don't know why. Every single time I lock in Hachiman, I just smack. But it never really feels like I do after the game's over. I don't know. That residual feeling of like, yeah, I'm good at this character. Doesn't stay. Like it does when I play like Poseidon or anyone else, I guess. <laughs> Alright. 
So we got his ult there. I did use my thorns, but um, there's no way in hell that I ever lived through that fight without popping thorns. Because the only way that that I ever win or live through the fight is popping thorns and him accidentally doing too much damage to himself or he has to run away because he can't fight anymore. <laughs> That's exactly what I did. Seek them out. Um, does he win these? Oh. Okay, Thorn's down. Finger over Aegis. Oh, he bracered, man. That was actually a winning play, turning, trying to turn that fight. But uh, I didn't expect his bracer to be up. Unfortunate. Good play. He might get tower. I don't know. Minions are coming in. Yeah, he's got tower. Alright. That's okay, that's okay. It's uh, really difficult to land stun on set because of the fact that he's so fast. So I'm pretty much just using it to gain distance. But I don't know, that might be a misplay. It might be better holding on to the three. Um longer in fights to see if I can potentially find a stun. I'm just farming up right now. Stand, my brethren. I want Aussie. I don't know if Xe would be king right now. I also don't know if I can do Bull Demon fast enough. He just teleported to speed buff. No, I don't think we can. I'm gonna try, but... Oh lord, he's coming. Oh lord, he's coming! <laughs> Am I that scared of him though? Right now? I don't know, we're kind of winning the fight. But if he ults me, do I just die? That's what I'm worried about. I think we back. I don't think we risk it. With Xe, I think we guaranteed win the fight as long as I can get my Aegis up. But if I wait for Aegis for the next fight, then I won't be able to get Phoenix. Ow. I think he just backed. We got 30 seconds on Bull Demon. I'm very upset. Oh my god. I'm very upset my stun didn't hit. I don't think he gets Phoenix because he doesn't have minions, but that Frostbite Hammer really fucked me up. I wonder, like, I want Toxic Blade and I want Itchival, but I don't know which one's better first. Probably Toxic. Honestly, that Executioner should have been a Toxic. That was a pretty big misplay. I think I have to wait for a Hyper Late Game, and I don't know if I win Hyper Late Game against Set. Because I fucked up my build by going XC instead of Toxic. And I don't know if you win Late Game Set.
Hmm. He did my blue, by the way. You cannot outrun the wind. Frostbound won't do anything for me, by the way, before anyone mentions it, because he's slow immune during his. Uh, he's slow immune during his three, so. And when you're set, you don't fight unless you have your three. Alright, Bull Demon is still down, so I'm gonna back now, sell Attacker's Blessing, and get Toxic Blade. <clears throat> and Bull Demon is spawning very shortly. Five seconds, maybe. Red is up. Alright, he ulted, so I'm just going to run away from this. Can't run from it? Oh my god. His alt is actually faster than my horse. I lose game here. Because he's got minions for Phoenix, so. Yeah, that's game over. Damn, dude. Unlucky. Wait, what are you doing? Okay, not game over, but it is my Phoenix. Oh, fuck. Your Phoenix has He's so fast when he ults. The only issue. Get Ichaval. Once I get Ichaval, I think that's the only chance I have of, of winning the, the game. Selling boots, I don't even know if that gives me anything. I might actually go Oboe instead of Ichaval, and then sell boots for Ichaval because I uh, my minion clear is not good. That actually might be the play to help for minion clear. Damn, he got Aussie too. Maybe I should have gone fucking Ankh, dude. I'm gonna go to to charge bow here. Yo, what? <laughs> he actually killed me there? Oh my god. I did so much more damage than him in every aspect of the fight. But, I guess Bracer plus Aussie plus his ult just healed him too much. I think I should have gone Ankh instead of Aegis. Aegis just wasn't up enough. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, guys, peace.